who wants him? There's no limit to what he could do. He could destroy the earth. You must say these words. Klaatu, Barada, Nikto. <sighs> definitely an inward. Klaatu, Barada, Nikto. Klaatu, Barada, Nikto! <laughs> Well, hey, once again, it's the Creep Show, Oak Ridge Creep with you, back with you once again. And I'll tell you what, it's praising to be alive here amongst all of us and all of you. Oh. That's right. Well, we've got a special guest host, and this is this is my cousin, this is Bobby McCorkin. How you doing, sir? Hey, I'm doing very good, very good, you know, just kicking like a doll, riding my horse, I'll get a little track, little hail, you know. All right, all right, so, 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 so you, you're in town for the weekend, and, uh, and uh, you just uh, kind of take a look around, maybe think about moving here, maybe, possibly. Is well, that a possibility? You know, I've been thinking about moving here, but I can't get all my kids and shit moving. I don't know. You know big thing about thing, you know. Well, hell, you know, I, I know how that goes, man. I, I used to be a test pilot for NASA, and we used to move around all the time. So, you know, I, I just don't uh, don't don't quite grasp, you know, the concept of staying in one place at one time. But, you know, good to have you along with us. Yeah, yeah. Good have you along with us tonight. Well, tonight we're going to cover uh, rednecks and inbreeding and the fine art of that, in fact, and uh, he's a fine example of that. Tell us about your exploits with inbreeding and redneckism. I mean, you're kind of the redneck of the uh, of the world uh, there, Bartley. Well, I ain't got no expert in it, but I know what my mom's from uh, up Boone County, West Virginia, and then we mm. might did, you know, go at it every once in a while, and that's it. You know, here I am, Bartley, mm -hmm. going on. Yeah, that's, that's how it works. Good but, to see you. Good well, to have you with us, man. I ain't seen you in a long time there, dude, but, you know. Yeah, well, I mean, you know, we're, we go back a long ways. You're, I think you're my uh, my cousin brother. I'm not quite sure how that worked oh, out, yeah. but it's good to have you along anyway. Oh, yeah, that's cool. That's cool. Anyway, tonight we're going to cover two movies and the topics of rednecks and inbreeding. Number one, Deliverance, and also a classic, A Boy and His Dog. And a matter of fact, uh, let's go ahead and cut to the deliverance clip, and uh, you'll see what we mean on the finer topic of inbreeding. <laughs> Thank you. 
guy. I believe you could, too. I believe you could. That's good. That's very good. Great. Damn, you play a mean banjo. Hey, you, you want to play another one? Give him a couple of bucks. Woohoo! Back home, good old days, and playing the banjo and getting busy. Oh, yeah. Man, you are not. That oh. one didn't look like my cousin Debra. <laughs> I swear, boy. I'll tell you what, mother boy, looks like uh, old Hank Williams back oh. there. Oh. Grand old life, wearing that banjo out. I'll tell you what. Hank Williams? It looks like Hank Williams. Yeah, Hank, Hank Williams, Williams ain't s. Man, my, my grandpa played guitar. He didn't get to do that two step thing. You ain't know nothing going on with it. Take me out, grandpappy. Right, well. Yeah. Whatever you want to say, man, I think it looks like Hank Williams. Well, if you want to say Hank Williams, I'll go with you. I mean, don't mean s*** to me. You're a good old boy, right? <laughs> hey, I tell you what, man, you know what, no. you. Man, I tell you what, that, 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 that's what restricts this old boy right here. He, you know, I tell you what, man, that, that clip reminds me back home in Oak Ridge, man, when we used to have a little get-together, play on the front porch like that, like that boy did right there. And, you know, I, I used to play a little guitar picking back when I was a young man. Well, yeah, man, just there in the... Go. We used to play squirrels like that on rocks, but they wouldn't sound nothing like a banjo. <laughs> Hell, I ain't know why I said that, man. <laughs> it just sound, sound like a bunch of s***. <laughs> I don't even know, man. <laughs> I'll tell you what, man. We got some funky-looking s*** <laughs> back up here in this, uh, in this grave. Well, I think I just said a little curse word there, but that's okay. We're all family here. We can cuss as loud. Yeah, right there. Yeah, what about that, when too, I man? I was like four, four or five months old. I shot a squirrel's head clear off his of body one day on that there. You believe that? It's some gun, man. I tell you, it's real crazy. That's all the creep family kind of town buried back in here. Now, now you see, we got some big fellas back in here, some trees back in the grove right there. There was some apples. Kind of reminds me of what that little scene was right there from the liver. And see, now that's uh, a... Hey, that, that looked like my old house I used to live at. You used to have a big porch like that, but we had a bunch of chickens sitting up there just shitting and feeding everywhere. <laughs> I didn't understand why. Oh, my Mom always said, get the chickens off the front porch, and then the, and Daddy started playing the banjo, and I don't understand. He started picking, going crazy, and then Grandpa, he started doing the slap, and he slapped shit. I don't even know, man. But the chickens, that reminds me of the porch with all yeah. the chickens. And what's up with that boy's tennis shoes? Look like wearing some Converse tennis shoes right up in there. Oh, he never damn socks pulled up, man. I don't even know. He had, yeah, but he had like these old... He's not a true shoes. redneck. He wearing shoes. That's for... P I ain't got no shoes on. Barefoot, I don't want barefoot since I was like two. I'll yeah. tell you what. I'll tell you what, man. That's just ain't that's the craziest but... thing. And what is, I mean, what's up with that old boy at City Slicker going, just clapping? Man, they just don't even know. City like Slickers, that. they drive their fancy old automobiles, bit like 19 something, but I drive me a red pickup truck, make more noise than a 747, and it's bad. It's awesome, man. What kind of pickup truck you got? I ain't even b no, I can't read. I mean, hell, it's, hell. It's red, it's loud, that's, you ain't got no windows, and I turn the older, you know, I turn the banjo picking on, and I just go f down on that, man. Ain't nothing like listening to old older, you know? Hell, yeah, you know, you have a gun rack in the back of that thing? Hey, you know, I got a gun rack, I got my piece and paw, all sorts of my shit in the back. Got a refrigerator I ain't got rid of, it's been there about three years. But uh, anyway. What you got, yeah, you got a little, it's little, 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 that's one of those uh, Phillies blunts, man. There ain't no Phillies blunts. Huh? Well, they ain't no roll this is on two fingers. Well, so good. Well, I'll tell you. That is right. awful. We're mighty fine, man. You want to taste it? Well, I can't. See, I'm hopefully disfigured. I can't get in yeah, there. I'm not even going to We used to go swim back in Oak Creek and that water. Oh, man. Well, f***ed you up, didn't it? Well, those skinny different men. Man, can I do something? We've never some? done that, man. We've got a butane that one day. We got real <laughs> f***ed up, man. <laughs> well, hell, man. Man, man. Boy, I tell you what, this is like an ultimate family reunion. We need to get the whole families together sometime. We, we all man, have big old... We missed you, buddy. Hell raising, you know? Oh, yeah, just hell raising. Out and run the do mud. Some, do, do some ass kicking. For real, yeah. ass kicking. All right, man. Well, we're going to, um, you know, thinking about things. It kind of reminds you, that clip reminds me of this old Pickens County Fair that uh, about five years ago. And I think we've got some footage of that. If we... Uh, have that ready in the high eight machine or whatever VHS three quarter. What the hell? The beta, I don't know. High what? High eight. Oh, man. High well, eight. Well, Let's take a look at this. Well, thing. well, I, I think, you know, well, it's going to take my kind of soap in that control room back up in there. They don't know what the hell they're doing back with something. What the hell are you talking about? I'm talking about a little footage clip. We're going to be rolling just a few minutes, man. Footage? Footage of picking the Oh, it's all about the TV, isn't it? Yeah. I ain't got no damn TV. You're going to have to talk my language, man. You can't be like, hi, and all that. Little box with I the screen in it. I thought you were talking about getting high or something, man. Hell. Well, hell.
Yeah. Huh? Well, I mean, it might as well be high. I mean, well, like, you ever sniff butane before? <laughs> yeah. That kid that on that playing the banjo, he looked like he a high on butane. He just hit that smile and playing the banjo. <laughs> can stop this man. Like, right. like I said, it looks like Hank Williams. He did. What? No, Hank Williams. They like don't look like Hank Williams. I don't, I don't even understand. Hank Williams. Well, I tell you what, man. Whoo! Whoo! like shindig or something. All right, well, let's uh, roll that uh, Pickens County Fair clip. Man, I love okay. this crap, man. This let's take a look at it. I'm here. all about it. Let's do it. Tell you what, man, that, that man, was, I that, cannot get enough of that leg twisting <laughs> they do on tape. I mean, that stuff's awesome. That's you see that one lady dancing? She's out there and started doing a boot scooting dance. What the hell? Damn, cow back on the. Man, y'all freaking me out with all this high eight. Listen, anyway, that guy that looked like just like Stella. You ever seen that girl? Oh, She's man. a crazy old bitch, man. She be, I tell you what. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> man, I'm telling you, well, I'm gonna like toward the end of this show. I'm gonna show you how to do some dancing, man. Well, hell, man, I'm looking yeah. forward to that. Man, look, like, you hear that Rocky to... Top song? Ain't nothing better than the Rocky Top song. Well, man. that's where I listen to that song. When I get up in the morning, I will get my shave on there. Thing, I have to listen to that song and just get me going in the morning. You know yeah. what I mean? Oh, man, man, I love that music, though. Can't get enough of that. Shit. It's that, it's that soul stirring. Uh, it Hallelujah. It's Praise it's right music. back home. Right when we used to swim in that river, man, Grandpa would get on there and pick that shit. And I just can't get enough of it, you know? I'll tell you, like I said, man, we got those backwoods, you know, little old get together family reunions, man. Man, we used to have. Rocky Top, wear your ass out, man. <laughs> man, man, we played that. We must have played it three or four hundred times. Oh, man. Oh, like no, we like all get together. We hold hands. This thing's Rocky Top. Yeah, right man, around the fire. We like all down together the and, and kind of swoop back and forth, <laughs> man. I'll tell you what, it just wore me out. Man, that man. That one time you were listening to Rocket Top and you just start going crazy or something. No, you man, I just, your hands. I just started. I just got crazy. I just stripped and jumped in the river, man. Yeah, I, I swear that was some crazy, crazy. That was stuff. a horrendous sight to behold, my friends. I'll tell you what. Well, moving on to our topic of the week. That's right. We're talking about rednecks and uh, inbreeding. And I got some footage pulled off the uh, World Wide Web this past week. And uh, let's take a look at this. Long before the first cat hat was down, I guess that's what you call it. Is that a cat hat? There. It's a classic redneck Classic hat. redneck. Well, yeah, classic redneck. Well, long before the first cat hat was done, the first cherry bomb muffler, and you got one of those. Oh, <laughs> hell yeah, I got one. I don't, even, I don't even think I ain't got one. I had to spend my f years worth of money to get one of them things, but it's way worth it. Well worth it. You know, was a, you know, cherry bomb muffler installed or the first pop top bracelet and my old wife has one of those. She looks mighty fine with that. I mean, you're all looking good. Man. Oh. You want to bring her over sometime. Well, we might do a little sharing with that. <laughs> I don't know why. Yeah. Probably try to score, you know. <laughs> you better believe it. Rednecks uh, from the earth long before this. And you can see right here, now we got, uh, now here's some old lager, friend. This is this Pete right up here. And let me kind of lean back here because I got a kind of kind of position. Well, this is Bill. This is Jackson Creek. And you hear all this machine gunner right back there. They used to do a lot of wood chopping and shooting people out of them. They're like, shit. Well, they used so to shoot people. Yeah, they used to do that's machine gunner. That's why we're like fun. Yeah, that's right, man. Mark there and shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Crazy. Who's BB? You know that big old tree sitting right there? Yeah, I know, man. That's, that's, that's a big that, tree. That, that, that's enough. That's some kindling right there for the family. Man, there ain't no kidding. We brought it out make a boat out of it. That's what we're going to do. That'll work. Man, make Little a boat, thing. raise some more hay on the boat. Ain't nothing better getting on Oak Ridge, like Oak Ridge, yeah, you know. Right. Get on the boat, getting getting fucked up, and drinking beer, just going to town in a boat made out of wood. Hell yeah. Ain't hey. nothing better, I tell you. Let's get to that other, uh, other, uh, Let's other go clip something there. else, Let's man. Let's see I it. Oh. Even... I've seen this, man. Come man, you dare us do it. All right, Come okay. on. Now, Whoa. <laughs> Good God. Oh, God. 
Man, that looked like my brother-in-law. Oh, he got he's a sexy bastard, didn't he? He ain't got I no teeth or nothing. He didn't have his parcels in before he left the house. He ain't got no, nothing wooden teeth, man. Ain't no parcels. Uh, that's what we call parcels. Well, you know, rocks, graphite, whatever you want to put in our teeth, man, you know. Man, man. Man, he is an ugly strong <laughs> bitch, so he ain't never going to get done, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Woo! Oh, my God, somebody. Man, like a pig. Yeah, hey, we'll that other clip right man, there. Let's we'll do more something else, man. I can't wait. More. Talking about the inbreed now. You, hey! You can see hey. here, there's the act of inbreeding. Look, you see his face? That's a face my inbred brother makes, man. Right when he's, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. There ain't what. nothing like that s. I tell you what, you need that job. You need that s. I tell you, whoa! I ain't even like oh, it. Oh, my goodness. Man, look at that face. It looks so like. You know, he looks so pissed off or so happy in one, you know. Yeah, I'll tell you what, like, uh, now, now, here, now, this is, now, here's Hank right here. Now, this is, this, man, is, this is, this is Hank Williams right here, man. That ain't Hank Williams. That, that's, that's, that's a little baby, that's a baby picture of you. You ain't got to lie. Man, yeah. that's a goddamn baby picture of you, and you going to tell me about Hank Williams. You don't look nothing like him. Get over it, mangled bastard. I tell you. I, I mean, just said you as a guest on here and you started calling me a bastard. Oh, uh, well, you know, I, 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 I don't mean friend. Bastard. Well, Remember back in the day we used to say bastard. Right, well. you know? Woo! Woo! Man, I still learn to read, man. I can't understand nothing this shit on the board. Well, let's go to our trivia question. All right, of the week you do it and I'll just sit here. This is something special. And uh, let me get this up here. This is kind of something in it. If you're like a big old movie buff like all of us are, in the movie Deliverance, what married with children, that's right, married with children actor and married with children on Fox played or actually cameoed in the hospital scene of the deliverance. Now, if you uh, know that, email us at creep at frank.mtsu.edu. What the hell are you doing, man? Well, you reading? I'm just entertaining myself. I'm just going with the goddamn trivia question. Oh, man, what the what. hell are you talking about anyway? I don't know. Deliverance. Man. Deliverance. Man, that was a good movie. Well, I'll tell you a question again. What? All right, well, they're telling us we got to go to a break. So. Well, I ain't going no goddamn break. I always going to listen to this shit. I don't even know nothing. If I can't afford none of shit on TV, they won't go commercial. I guess we'll do it. All right, well, stay away. We'll be right back after We'll this. be right back, and I'm going to get me no cigars because i got to get this down my nose. It ain't tasting no good no more. Stay later, f*** it. Has this ever happened to you? Are you tired of getting burned in the shower? Well, you don't have to take it anymore. Now, try the amazing Bucket of Ice. With easy installation, the Bucket of Ice offers instant cooling satisfaction for those nasty shower burns. The amazing Bucket of Ice can be yours, and if you act now, you'll receive this second fast-action ripcord for those persistent flushers. Send 1995 to Bucket of Ice, 1735 Arctic Avenue, Fargo, North Dakota, 27112. You know, when I'm not playing Pay Pay on Channel 8, people ask, I say, Peter, what's the softest thing that you put on? Is it the Dove Moisturizing Body Wash? No. Nope. Is it the little creams and lotions you rub on yourself? Wrong again. It's the silk, isn't it? No. Ooh. What is the softest thing that you put on? I put on the creep show, silly. Creep show on every night, 11 o'clock. Watch it. Hey, welcome back. I tell you. God, I feel like doing that, man. Every time hey. I see that commercial with you and that and shit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. 
<laughs> that BTV, and I encourage you to watch that. Right there, man. Oh, yeah. There ain't no better on TV than that funny ass shit. Well, I don't know. You know, we don't got bitch death about doing shit wrong. Yeah, you know. Well, I tell you what. It's like good old days when we raise hell and the law comes chasing after and we try to raise out, race them in, and the next thing you know, bam, we in a car wreck. <laughs> 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 oh, it's so much fun. I'll tell you what, let's go to our next, uh, we're going to enter our next movie, A Boy and His Dog. And uh, this is uh, a 1973 B cult classic starring our old pal Don Johnson of. Uh, 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 Miami Vice fame. <laughs> you getting kind of big about that? You like Don Johnson, don't you, man? What? You, okay. <laughs> yeah, well. Go ahead, whatever you gonna do. All right, man. You, 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 you take them f my brain on hell. <laughs> the hell, dude, I'll tell you. Don Johnson of, uh, of Miami Vice fame and Nash Bridges fame and, uh, this is a clip about talking about inbreeding to its very much finest, and this is a prime example of what it looks. I mean, what the hell are you doing, man? Well, hell, you. You had a Cody, man. I'm going. You ain't never had no white girl named Cody, man. You ain't that. Cody, Cody, man. My God! Oh, a little tone there. You hear that? Well, I think it's that. <laughs> well, I tell you what. Let's go and roll that boy and his dog, 1973, Don Johnson. Let's take a look at it. Can't get pregnant every once in a while. We need new blood. We need a new man. We are never so happy, nor so new unhappy, man. as we imagine. Another helpful hint for living from the committee's special Almanac. kind of man. <laughs> <laughs> You want me to knock up your bride? <laughs> you talked me into it. Line them up. You first, honey. Take your hands off me. <laughs> Die together, we beseech thee in the way of righteousness and peace that loving and serving thee with one heart and mind all the days of their life, they may be abundantly enriched with the tokens of thy everlasting favor. Amen. By authority vested in me by the committee, I hereby pronounce you husband and wife according to the ordinances and the laws of the state of Topeka. What God has joined together, let no man put son. Amen. Should never be ashamed to own he has been in the wrong. Which is but saying that he is wiser today than he was yesterday. Another helpful hint for living from the committee's almanac. And be sure to get both parents inside right here and have a see brother hat. Oh, Woo! I love doing that out there in Blue Clip, man. It's yeah, so fun. I said, all those little bobs are mighty nice. I think I could explain. Hey, explore. did you see them all the animals, man? I yeah. One day, my mama come home from uh, the penitentiary. Yeah. And she done bought me a new pair of old bobs. She said, what the hell was that? Man, y'all gonna have to quit doing that. It's freaking me out. I think about something back in the cinema, man. man. I don't know how it is. Man, you don't even know. I gotta get a guy to 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 get a guy
I'll tell you what, but you know. Whoa, my goodness. Man, <laughs> shit coming out of here. Man, whoa. Hey, whoa, it's that like at home. I gotta go. I gotta go to the chicken floor. I'm getting blue. Whoa, whoa. You know. <laughs> I'll tell you what, that's some crazy motherfucking Woo. Tell you what. Oh, yeah, I tell you what, this is, this is Bartley McCork and the eye at his finest, folks. I, 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 I tell you, I, I, yes. Man, man, man. I tell you, yes. You ever watch this shit? Woo, gone. Didn't feel like a motherfucker. I tell you what, man. That's awful crazy. Hey, love, drop, 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 drop. Man, I'm kind of scared out in this graveyard, man. Well, this is where the home is. This is the family, family bed back over here. Like you see, your grandpa's got that girl back over there. It looks kind of nice, you know. We keep it clean, get it weed. Man, you helping butane to that thing? I think I am, man. Because <laughs> you need a lot. Let's go ahead and let's go ahead and tell my trivia question man, once again. Because I don't think you quite got it. And we're done with this one. Well, we're gonna have to try it again. All okay, right. Our question of the week was related to a Christmas song. Oh, yeah. 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 Ye